Hello, hello! Hi everyone, I hope you're doing fantastic and working on it. Welcome to my Claire's Receiving Exercise 2 video. Yay, yay, yay! So now that we've done the Claire's Receiving Exercise 1, and we've gotten familiar with the chakras that are connected to the Claire's, clear feeling, hearing, seeing, and knowing, and we've used frequency to come to the knowledge of when we are in that particular clear because the frequency will trigger activity in that specific area uh, you know we are able then to feel when we're receiving more whether it is that we're reading a soul that is still here on earth or we are reading uh and receiving from a visiting spirit from the other side of life so i want to begin with the second part of this exercise which is understanding how to receive but not using now the frequency for each chakra but asking the spirit world to actually draw near to us for the awareness and the buildup of the power so basically we're going to be in the power of a reading outside of a reading and we are going to ask our loved ones on the other side or just some light beings that like to help because believe it or not there are souls that like to help even though they are on the other side of life and of course they're always high light beings um, your intention is your outcome and your outcome is your intention and so we ask them to come in, but the way that it works with the shock receiving exercise too is that we ask a visiting spirit, whether you choose it to be a loved one or just, you know, any, any, everybody and anybody to come in from the other side of life and build the power in each clear one by one. So for example, you would play their frequency of 417 for the solar plexus chakra but then i'm sorry 528 417 is the sacral so it's 528 for your solar plexus chakra and then you would ask a visiting spirit to come in and give you a feeling of a memory that they choose let me feel a memory allow me to feel a memory okay so then you would sit and you would sit with the feeling of that power when you're receiving now with the solar plexus and again that vibrates at a 520 hertz we understand and we know that this is where the power builds up and why is it that it builds up in this center well this is where we feel everything because this is connected to our nervous system. So, of course, it's going to be where we receive um, the power and we're able to recognize, hey, there is something that is with me now that was outside of my natural flow within my aura. So, we ask the visiting spirit from the other side of life to come in, choose a memory, and let me feel a memory let me feel a memory and and it's fantastic and amazing how you slowly begin to feel the shift okay and then we proceed and we go up to say let me hear something of that memory let me hear something of that memory and we focus on our clear audience which is again vibrating at a 741 hertz right so the higher we go in clears the higher the frequency gets so when we're working with our clear hearing that is connected to your throat chakra all right it's connected to your throat chakra and we ask again to allow the power to build and to 
hear something from that memory even if you're reading psychically you can do this because again you're just going to focus on something that the sitter is asking you and go through your clears instead of receiving a memory from someone coming in from the other side of life okay so you can use this again for both then we will proceed and we would do through, we would do this through our clairvoyance let me see something in reference to this memory let me see it all right so again we're completing our clairs we felt it we saw it and now we're asking to see it okay and then you ask okay let me know that i want to say something drop some thoughts in very quickly let me know that i want to say something and again you know not only are you now recognizing and staying in that place of recognizing each way that you receive but with the chakra the clears receiving exercise too you're actually building the power you're building the power to be able to um, you know have a stronger and longer reading okay because again you can't just plug i mean you can bring your awareness and you can go right in you know um, but this is going to be this will be very beneficial for you in reference to building the tolerance of sitting in the power of a reading outside of a reading and again you can say hey uh you know i want to do this for five minutes and then five minutes just becomes so easy and next thing you know you're doing 10 minutes and it feels very easy but in the beginning when you're sitting you might feel a little tired afterwards or so thirsty right so the physical body goes through um you know this adjustment period to build the tolerance to be able to be in those clears for a longer period of time keeping that that inpouring and outpouring of power during your readings again whether that's psychic where the that's mediumistic or even in healing to be honest so with the second part we are really just pushing out our aura and again that's visualizing white light from your heart center and on the exhale pushing it out filling the room that you're in all right and then you're pushing out each color of your chakra, starting from the root all the way to the third eye, one by one, going up. So visualizing the root, pushing out the ruby red, going up to your sacral, pushing out the tangerine orange, going up to your solar, pushing out that beautiful sunshine yellow, and again, so on and so forth until you get to your third eye. And now you're expanded and you're in that blended state. Where the spirit world can see and feel you and then your intention will be the gps now what do you want to do now i want a loved one to come near to me dad come near to me in spirit or mom or whomever it is come near to me and give bring a memory let me feel it let me hear it let me see it let me know that i want to say so with one we're getting acquainted with the power that we're pushing out and the power that is coming in and is becoming one okay so that expanded consciousness and the consciousness of all that is creates the power and of course our passion and love that we have when we're doing this work so again the second part of this is all about building the tolerance within our clears which is clear feeling hearing seeing and knowing so you would push out your aura and then you would, you know, ask for a visiting spirit to come in again, whether that's a loved one or someone else, uh, you know, a helpful light being from the other side. Come on in and bring a memory. Let me feel it. Stay with that for a bit. Then let me hear it. Stay with that for a bit. Then let me see it. Stay with that for a bit. And then let me know that I want to say. So I hope that this second part is helpful. And again, do this until you really feel the shift in energy and that builds the confidence of knowing something is definitely happening here there is definitely a buildup of power i can't deny it right and this will help you to really come into a place of balance and and trust with the fact that there is life after death and that we can read each other's souls and we can heal each other as well by coming into our auric field and sharing that space so I hope that this was a bit helpful for you. And again, with each clear, you're going to play the frequency. For example, the solar plexus is your clear feeling. You're going to play 520 hertz 
and then you're going to ask the spirit world to draw near to you after you're expanded in that blended state and tell you know give you a memory that you can hear feel see and know and then you're going to do that all the way one by one feeling it hearing it seeing it and then knowing it and the more that you do this the more that you feel comfortable in understanding when you're in those places of receiving i hope this helps this is lillian suarez and be looking out for claire's receiving exercise three video bye for now